why does my vest look so dirty oh my gosh i think it's my camera my my vest is actually dirty oh wow let's just ignore the stains i'm actually very disappointed because this is my favorite sweater vest hello everyone welcome back to my channel so i've put together some very girly preppy pinterest inspired outfits that kind of gives off that preppy princess look i'm not sure if preppy princess is like the term i would use to describe this specific aesthetic but basically i would say it's a mix between like light academia and dark academia but it's more focused on very softer lighter colors especially pink i think that's what i'm gonna call this aesthetic kind of like pink academia but you can mix other colors in there and just keep it very light and girly and you have crappy princess okay so i've put together some outfit ideas to show you guys and i'm also going to talk about like the basic pieces that you need in your wardrobe to achieve this aesthetic i just feel like it's it's super trendy and all the cool girls are wearing it all the cool girls have this aesthetic and all of these pieces i'm going to share with you guys so keep on watching if you want to achieve this aesthetic so i'm gonna first just talk about like the basic pieces that you need i'm sure you have like most of these pieces already i just feel like every girl should like have these staple pieces the first that i want to talk about is a tennis skirt and i have talked about tennis skirt like in every single one of my videos it is my favorite piece of clothing i wear it with every and anything and you don't have to be a girl a girl to wear a tennis skirt or to own a tennis skirt i really really would recommend owning a tennis skirt so this is the first outfit i love this for just going out for like i don't know just like a casual little day um i just love the tennis skirt it gives me a super preppy look i just feel like it gives me a very subtle like preppy princess look it's super girly it's super casual and it's just something that i would just wear out to go get my nails done or go to the grocery store meet up with some friends i just feel like it's such a little cute outfit for stuff like that i love pairing like crop cardigans like this with my tennis skirt okay so the next piece of clothing that i really really believe everyone should own is a white button down i love it because it's super sophisticated it's super girly super studious you can never go wrong with a white button down honestly i just feel like everyone should own it it's just such a classic piece in everyone's wardrobe and I just feel like it's a must. Like, who doesn't own a white button down? Like, that's just weird if you don't. You know what I mean? I've always had like a white button down and like I never wear it, but I just, I just have it for like, I don't know, emergencies? I just love how a white button down can be such a classic piece of clothing. I can just wear it with some jeans and I have like a Parisian outfit. I also love that I can wear it under a sweater or a sweatshirt and it's a total preppy look. I just love the many different aesthetic you can create with a white button down. You don't always want to wear a collared shirt all the time to achieve that preppy girly look. Okay, I seriously cannot find my white button down shirt, which is embarrassing because we're just talking about how everyone needs one. It's probably in the wash somewhere, but this is the next best thing that I have. This is like a very light chiffon like a button up blouse this is actually a button up blouse this look is giving a very clueless sheer vibes i have my collared blouse outside of my skirt and i have this little vest over it i mean this outfit is so cute i love it so much it's definitely giving that princess preppy vibes and of course a matching headband and this is like my favorite look my favorite preppy look ever and so the next item is sweater vests. I just love the whole concept of sweater vests because I love that during the spring and early summer, I can wear it as a top and jeans. I just feel like that's such a look. It's so comfortable. It's so casual. It's like very put together. So another sweater vest look. This one, I love this one. I have no idea like what to pair this vest with yet but for now i'm just gonna pair it with like these 
I don't know how I feel about this look. Um, usually I'll go with some light wash jeans or just like some shorts, but I feel like I want it to have like some kind of contrast happening here and I just don't think that it was working out. You know what, this is not happening for me. I'm just gonna pair with some jeans. Yes, this is so much better. No matchy matchy with the flowers. This needs a darker bottom for sure. I think this looks so much better. I love it. I feel like I can go ride my bike in this outfit. I don't have a bike yet, but when I do, <laughs> this is what I would probably wear. Okay, this is such a bike outfit. I mean, I don't normally wear hats. Like, it's not my thing. Pigtails will look so cute with this outfit. I just wish the hat would match, but it doesn't. And you know what? It's fine. I'll wear like white sneakers to match the hat and I think it'll be like perfect. You guys, oh my gosh, what is happening? I just feel like this is not preppy, but like I can make it preppy. Okay, I don't see a lot of like preppy outfits that includes jeans and shorts. It definitely think that you can incorporate jeans into a preppy look with accessories so like a headband a tote bag i mean how can you not tell me if this is like a pinterest girl look the hat would definitely match my tote bag oh my gosh now this look is giving me like farmer's market vibe next i want to talk about blazers and i feel like not a lot of people or like not a lot of Pinterest girls who are super preppy and bookish wear blazers. I feel like they keep the whole aesthetic very soft girl-ish by just wearing sweaters and sweater vests and collared shirt. But I feel like blazers should be like a must with this preppy girl outfit, especially a tweed blazer. It's giving total Gossip Girl vibes, but it's also giving very Pinterest girl vibes. And I love that, especially a pink blazer. Now this is definitely giving me major old money vibes. I just love like an all white outfit and just like a cardigan or a blazer or a little jacket with some kind of color to just pop the look. If I wanted to, I could go in with like a planer, like a t-shirt almost, but I have like, I don't even own a plain white t-shirt, which is so sad. But obviously I probably wouldn't wear this shirt inside of this because collar and collar just don't um but let's just pretend this is a plain white t-shirt because yeah i really really like it with the blazer just button up like this i feel like this looks so cute i love it honestly i am here for it um not the top let's just ignore the top for a second okay definitely see myself wearing this with flat but i think what i really like most but these loafers are kind of screaming to me because of the gold detailing i don't know how i feel about pairing like a beige slash off-white with white um can i do that this is so so cute i'm actually gonna try this with the pink blazer i feel like that will give me a more preppy princess look yeah this is definitely giving me more of a preppy princess girl look um i can't believe this blazer is an extra small and it looks so huge on me i feel like zara's sizing are so off these days like I just can't seem to find anything that fits perfectly. I would wear this with a high turtleneck. I definitely would see myself wearing this with flats for sure because I just feel like the blazer just adds like that very girly, sophisticated look. And I don't want to dress this down because this blazer just looks so cute. And I just feel like we should just keep the look cute with some flats. I feel like a very important pattern to achieve this preppy princess Pinterest girl aesthetic. Wow, that is a mouthful. We need to like abbreviate that. We'll call it the three P's. Okay, so the pattern I feel like we definitely need to incorporate into this aesthetic is Argyle. So Argyle pattern is like 
the preppy girl's best friend like tell me i don't scream pinterest preppy girl with this look I have been having such a hard time trying to match the sweater with something. I feel like a black skirt is just doesn't look good with it and a white skirt is super girly with it. Really wanted to keep like the look a little bit darker but like not too dark if you know what I mean. I found a skirt that matches exactly like it is just the same exact shade of navy blue okay, this is another argyle sweater look and it's just a simple black and white look which is very casual i love it and but it's definitely girly like it totally screams girly i just automatically think you're super smart if you wear like an argyle sweater I just know that you read a lot of books and you spend most of your time at the bookstore and you have a copious amount of books in your room and you just don't want to be bothered so that's the kind of vibe i get off of people who wear argyle sweaters and you know what i think it's an amazing vibe oversized sweatshirts are my newest obsession and i just love how so many pinterest girls are styling oversized sweatshirts this is probably another bookstore outfit because i actually live at the bookstore so all of my outfits are bookstore appropriate fyi if you're not really like a skirt and sweatshirt type of person definitely switch this out with some jeans mom jeans for sure i think will look really cute with like oversized sweatshirts i love it and wear a collared shirt inside to just give you that preppiness and you're good to go don't forget your headband and don't forget your tote bag i've been talking about clothing all throughout this video but let's talk about shoes i feel like not a lot of people talk about shoes and like what kind of shoes to wear but I'm going to tell you some of my favorite shoes currently that I love to wear with preppy outfits and shoes that I kind of want to try. So like Mary Jane's I feel like is super, super popular and trendy right now. Not just the preppy girls are wearing it, but just the princess girls are wearing it, the classy girls, the Parisian chic girls. I just feel like every type of aesthetic is literally into Mary Jane's and at first I'm like mm, those just like doesn't really scream me I just I don't think I could pull them off and but they just look so cute and there's like really really cute ones that don't look like children's shoes so I think maybe I'll try them and see how they look but if that's really your thing and you don't have a preference for shoes and you just want to feel like a cutesy little girly girl um I've definitely would say mary jane's especially white ones another pair of shoes that i really really like for this preppy aesthetic is loafers and i'm talking about the loafers with the buckles not too chunky loafers because i know there's like super chunky loafers that are trending right now and i just don't like them i just feel like they look so heavy on you i mean some girls can really pull that look off and it looks so good i cannot for the life of me find a pair of loafers that are not too bulky or chunky or have like giant chains wrap around them because that's i don't really like that but if you're into that by all means wear it because i feel like it looks so good on some outfits and there's just some outfits like there's just like specific outfits that i'll like only pair with loafers very very important accessory i definitely recommend is headband i mean how could you not wear a headband if you're claiming the pinterest preppy girl aesthetic if this is your aesthetic you literally have to own like 100 pairs of headbands in every style every color every shape so the very last thing i truly believe you guys need to have in your life as a preppy pinterest girl is a tote bag oh my gosh don't claim yourself as a preppy girl if you don't own a tote bag honestly i mean i could be in like the ugliest outfit and i have my headband on and my my tote bag and i'm fine like i'm totally fine okay you guys that concludes my little outfit idea video thanks so much for watching don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video and follow me on instagram for more outfit ideas and i'll see you guys in my next video bye